Welcome to the Nomadic King channel. I'm James Showers, cleanest name in the biz, and today we are heading to Home Depot. We are going to be marching through those doors. We're going to be looking past all those power tools. I'm skipping. I'm scooting down the aisle right by the totes and the toolboxes to find the tool bags. This aisle is in complete disarray. That's all right. Let's go ahead and start the show. For around $30, I found this nylon tool bag set. Now, it is kind of cheap. It's a little bit small. It's not gonna have a bag for every single one of your tools, but hey man, $30, get the tool bags and start working today. Moving right along, we have an apron style. This is leather though. This is something my wife would actually probably wear or somebody that's doing like a finished carpentry type thing. Maybe even some kind of homeowner would probably buy this, but for $32, this would definitely work if you're just doing some small projects around the house. Up next, we have one of our first bigger, batter sets of tool bags. This is for $100. It's a nylon set. It has most of the pouches and bags that you're gonna want for everyday carpentry or professional type of work. It's got a hammer holder on the back. It comes with a suspender set. It's all padded. I think this is actually a fairly decent deal even at the $100 price point. Now this is the last set of tool bags we have and for $140 you get a complete set of leathers. Yes, this is nothing close to an Occidental set, but for $140 you really can't beat a nice set of leathers. It's got all the bags and pouches that you're going to want for most every type of carpentry profession. These tool bags also had a padded belt and all the loops set up for suspenders. Now the rest of the tool bags were actually just single pouches for specialty profession along with cell phone holders and knee pads. You already know you need some of those on your tool kit. Guys, what did you think about what they have over here at this Home Depot? As you can see, this whole section was in complete shambles, guys. Not too much to really choose from. But if you've had better luck finding some killer tool bags at Home Depot, let everyone know what they are and how much they cost in the comments down below.